Hello for lover, I'm Timena and today on Coco Cooking we're going to be baking one of my favourite dishes, a paifala or a pineapple pie. That Samoan Tongan and every island favourite. It's not like the palangi idea of a pie. These ones are made in big roasting pan type dishes to feed the masses. Or the famous half moon pies just made for one. Whether you like it with lashings of meringue or clouds of cream, this dish is top of the pops of island desserts. So this is the size of our tray. We're making a pretty big pie phala today. And for the base, we're gonna need one pound of butter, which is about two blocks, four cups of self-raising flour, four eggs, and one cup of sugar. For the filling, we're going to use three crushed pineapples, or you can use three cans of crushed pineapples. You can use anything you'd like for the topping, meringue or whipped cream topped with peanuts or chocolate flakes, it's up to you. So what we're doing now is we are going to cream the butter with the sugar. So pie is a pretty big deal in our family. Whenever we have a kornai or a family gathering, we always have a pie fala there because it's just an essential dessert, really. There are so many different variations of pineapple pie. Some people thicken their filling with corn flour, some add sugar, while some use custard as a base. My favourite is the pie fala with a good custard filling and a nice sweet shortbread base that crumbles then melts in your mouth. So we're putting our pastry into a greased tray and you don't want it to be too thick, so really make sure you spread it out across the tray. To make our filling, we're going to put our crushed pineapple on the stove, bring it to the boil and then thicken it with pre-made custard. I'm not